<laughs> oh, God. Well, that wasn't as funny as I imagined it oh. could be. But you were telling me about that St. Patty's Day story you had. Oh, when I got arrested? <laughs> fucking hilarious, yeah. I did get fucking caught in the claws of the law at a How young age. How fucked up were you? Blacked out. It was We started drinking at 11 in the morning. By noon, my friend had pissed his pants. Holy shit. In a parking man. lot of a pizza place. How's that possible? We just we were fucking getting hammered. We were like just drinking liquor, getting fucked up. And then like he actually went to lift a cooler. We were helping lift a cooler <laughs> into his sister's car. And as he lifted it, we put it in. He's like, oh, I fucking pissed my pants. <laughs> <laughs> and then he still went out in public? We went from that parking lot into the pizza place, ate a bunch of food. I think actually I proposed to the waitress at one point. Nice. So like people weren't feeling that at all. It was oh, fucking. It was like God. twelve o'clock. On a, Did it was you get new. down on a knee in a crowded 100%. pizza shop? One hundred percent. Like a, a crowded pizza shop, just fucking hammered. Just like you're so hot. Will you marry me? <laughs> Holy fuck, dude! I would have hated you. So, I mean, you would have hated you. Yeah. What a but I was. I was literally like blacked out. And then I we went into the. Uh, Wait, uh, how long ago was this? I was twenty one. Oh, okay. So it was like nine years all ago, right, or whatever right, it was. Right. I was yeah, fucking yeah, yeah. shit faced. I like vaguely remember that. Is that when did you like kind of stop drinking? When I was like 23, when I graduated college, yeah, I slowed it down. Big Is that time. when you were like, I have a gluten allergy and like, I'm no, a actually, that was like 20. Yeah, that was right around like 22, 23. I was like, actually, I have a gluten allergy. So like, uh, I know what it's like. It's an autoimmune disorder. <laughs> but yeah, I, I I got arrested. So my friend got my friend who peed his pants. No surprise, got kicked out for I don't know what the fuck. But you guys were at a bar. So we, there was a pizza place. It was like a restaurant. Connected to a bar. Okay. So, like, there was a bar next to the actual, like, place where you eat. Yeah. So, he took it from the pizza place to the bar, like, 50 feet away. He got kicked out of the bar. Where was this? In Wilmington, Delaware. Grotto, okay. Grotto's Pizza. <laughs> so, we got... He got kicked out. So, I went out. I'm like, dude, get back in here. I was doing car bomb races with people. I'd be like, get a car bomb. Whoever loses pays. And I was crushing people. So, I, I was, like, five car bombs. It was the first time I ever did them. I was like, these things are delicious. And I kept fucking drinking them. Oh. So, I'm fucking wasted. And then, like, I go back out. I spent, like, 60 bucks on my credit card. So, I went to my friend. And I was like, dude, I've spent a lot of money in there. Just come in with me. <laughs> and I'll smooth it friend. Out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, was, I spent, like, 67 on a MasterCard. And I was like, I'll smooth it over with the owner. Trust me. We'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, you're getting fucking bottle service. <laughs> yeah. So, I bring him back in, and the guy's instantly like, get the fuck out. I just kicked you out. And I was like, sir, please, can we talk? And I was like, as a businessman. You tried to white talk your way back in, dude. Yeah. Uh, excuse me. I was me. like, sir, as a business major. And he's just like, dude, shut the fuck up. Oh, you talked about your major? I was like, talking about how oh. I was like a businessman. And he was like, dude, he's like, oh my God. I'll call the cops. And I was like, call the fucking cops. And then the fucking cops came and just dragged me the fuck out of there. I was like the Asian dude on the airplane, dude. They fucking pulled me the fuck out. I was like, yeah. Forgot about the Asian <laughs> screaming, dude. <Yeah. laughs> there was no fucking. No one was videotaping my case back then, dude. There was no white lady like this. Is this wrong. is wrong. Oh, no, it was just me, dude, trying to stick up for my constitutional rights. That fucking Chinaman was sticking up for his rights. <laughs> he was, dude. He paid for a seat. He got fucking bullied out, dude. <laughs> they hit his face on an armrest <laughs> on the way out. <laughs> They got him. They bonked his nose. Oh, my God. Dude, but they fucking... His fucking dead weight, lifeless body when they're dragging him out with his belly out is the funniest <laughs> fucking thing. <laughs> Just dragging him down a plane aisle. Oh, my God. Dude, oh I'm telling you, though, God. how relieved would you be if, like, you were late on your flight and you're like, someone get the fuck... And they dragged him out. There was definitely people secretly like, yes, get the Dude, fuck out. If I was... Uh... If I was sitting next to the guy, I would have been fucking. Him, <laughs> get dude. the fuck like, out, get out, dude! dude. <laughs> you got picked. It was a fucking lottery. Yeah, and how fucking funny that would be to see this dude trying to dead weight and fucking be like, "This is gonna be him getting dragged out." Would be the funniest thing I've ever seen. The funniest would be me trying to share my viral video and just me like, "Ha ha ha!" ha. They're like, "Dude, can't fucking cut that out!" I'm like, this is wrong. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so you're in the bar. Yeah, I'm in the bar, and. uh so I'm, it's the owner of the cops come. They fucking toss you right out. I'm, the, the, I'm, I'm an Asian professor, dude. They fucking <laughs> snag me out of there. So I, I get in the cop car and I'm like, this is wrong. Blah, blah, blah. And they're like, shut up. And uh, they start yelling at me. And I was just like, yeah, well, you guys just fucking blowing each other around the corner. And they're like, fuck you. We'll take you out of this car and beat your ass. And I was like, <laughs> my uncle's a fucking lawyer. I'll have your fucking badge. And they're, <laughs> they're like, fuck you. You're full of shit. And then we like went five minutes. When I got close to the police station, I just started crying my eyes out. I was like, this always happens to me. It's so unfair. <laughs> fucking crying. The fucking ship swung down the other way. 
Dude, they're like, the, shut up, you fucking pussy. You're fucking line crying. Is, the line, this is always uh, happens to me. That's all I remember is being like, this stuff happens to me all the time. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> and then I got instantly got into the cell and started like well, I was it was just me it was this is like one thirty p.m. so it's just me fucking in a cell no one's in the holding cell just there's two you cops were the first fucking guy first on motherfucker Patty's plucked day. out on St. Pat <laughs> twenty one my first time at bat on St. Patty's Day did not go well so they fucking uh, <laughs> they take me so I'm in there by myself and I just start rattling the cage like spitting like stop fucking spitting I was like yeah why don't you come on to my side and talk to me and like dude you just cried in the fucking car you're not tough I was like fuck you guys <laughs> I was doing push ups and shit I swear to god I was down there doing like push ups I was, dude I was wiling out oh god dude and then the uh, I fell asleep and the guards changed and it was packed and everyone was in there like fucking go it was just a bunch of me's from before like fuck this <laughs> So I woke up and I was like, yo, why don't you fucking just take it easy? Let the cops do their jobs. And then one guy was a new person. He's like, what are you doing here? I was like, nah, my friend was drunk. I got in trouble. I don't know. And they fucking let me right out. Oh, God. And then I went to court for it. Fucking skated. Button up shirt, dude. I put on the fucking, I put on the white privilege fucking garb, dude. And went in there, combed my hair to the right, which is code sign of the judge. Like, good family, let me out. True. <laughs> I was True. like, your honor, I'm really embarrassed about my actions. I don't know. I just, uh, actually, actually first I have a gluten allergy. <laughs> I have a gluten allergy. The judge was like, oh, man. Oh, no. I hope you're okay. <laughs> it was a CrossFit activity issue, and I got very sickly, and I called the cops gay. And <laughs> yeah, at one point, I literally, while I was in the holding cell, they were like, dude, the judge can see you. And I was like, no, she fucking can't, or they can't. And I like, looked up at the camera. I was like, fuck the judge. <laughs> <laughs> I was going full mutiny. <laughs> fuck the judge. <laughs> They were like, yeah, good one, asshole. Dude, you standing in the middle of a fucking drunk day <laughs> looking at a camera and be like, fuck the judge, baby. <laughs> I was like, just found out about it, the Illuminati, too, and I was like, fucking judge can't do shit. <laughs> you won't quiet me. I was fully convinced in my head that I was like being like my civil liberties being taken from me, and I was like totally. Oh, God. Like I, in my head, I was pure 1776, dude, in that yeah. fucking holding cell. Fucking like, Alex Jones, is, dude. The fucking British have got me, dude. <laughs> Oh, man, that's fucking great. That was fun. You fucking folded like a bitch when we got arrested in South Carolina. I dude. dude I'd no, fucking, you didn't fold I'd at been all. in the system. I did. You, dude, were, you, were, <laughs> you were totally rational. I was being a dickhead. That was so funny. We, got, we were doing a bunch of shows in the South, and one night in South Carolina, we decided to blaze some of fucking Jaws herb, dude, yeah. and go to a diner. <laughs> and on the way there, we were smoking out of Matt's bowl, his fucking, like, Gandalf bowl. It was this huge, ornate, like, curvy wooden, or uh, oh, God. curvy glass pipe. Almost could be shaped like a dragon, but not like a... It was, it was ridiculous. Like tons of bends and curves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, Weird to uh, carry in your pocket. We were just walking around smoking that. <laughs> and, uh, we were in it was South late, Carolina. Man. It was yeah. late. It was like 2. 2 o'clock in the morning, South Carolina, walking up the highway. The street, tried to cross the street to a closed <laughs> diner. So I ran across the highway. He jaywalked. I jaywalked. It wasn't a highway. It was, it was at two an lane, intersection. Two lane, yeah. But it was for the cross. It was, yeah. Yeah, it was a two lane road. And uh, the cop was pretty far away. I thought he was, but he the sped up. The car was fucking far away, and when he saw my big he ass... He ran across, Shane ran across and got like one Grand Theft Auto star, dude. <laughs> yeah, I did, dude. I, I fucking, I jaywalked, and it turned out that it was a cop. Like, the lights came on. <laughs> so I blew the fucking weed out of the bowl, yeah, Matt, so I didn't Matt have anything. went into full fucking instinct mode. Got rid of that cherry, dude. Got oh, dude, I, the cherry was still burning, dude. I sacrificed it into the parking lot of like the Waffle but House. But you, you kept the bowl, dude. Yeah. You're not going to lose that piece. I, I thought about smashing it, and I was like, nah, dude, this is my brother's. I like like this one. <laughs> You'll take the fucking charges, dude. Yeah. So this cop pulls us over and like across the street, he's like, I can smell weed on you. <laughs> he smelled weed from like. Well, I stood across the street for a second. Like, do I go over there? He's like, get over here. And I was like, oh, fuck. And I walked yeah, over. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Which he shouldn't have brought you over, but whatever. I, mean, I was just standing. You were, I was you just were like an this. accomplice to a jaywalking. I was just standing across the street like, <laughs> he's like, you over here. I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Yeah, so we're just standing there at the hood of his car, and he's like, do you have anything in your pockets? And Matt puts this ridiculous piece <laughs> out on his hood, <laughs> this douchey fucking weed pipe. <laughs> and he's like, do you have anything in there? Matt's like, nope, there is nothing in there. <laughs> he blew out the weed. <laughs> and then, Meanwhile, the cop was literally maybe 20 years he old. Was probably, he, was he was probably kid. 20, 21 yeah. in a full fucking SWAT gear. He was dressed fucking. like mocap from Little Cop. Yeah, dude. He thought he was the <laughs> man. And I could not stop laughing in this guy's fucking face about how gay he was, dude. So I was laughing. The start to finish, I was laughing. And I kept, he got back in his car to like start giving us a ticket. 
And I was like, this guy's fucking giving us bullshit. And I was just laughing. Oh, my and Matt, God. And Matt kept being like, shut up, dude. He's <laughs> gonna, I, I, I thought we were getting a warning. I thought we were getting a warning. And Shane kept laughing. I'm like, this guy sees Shane laughing. We're going to get a real fucking jaywalking ticket. So suck. <laughs> And I'd be like, Shane, I wouldn't do that if I were you. I was not going to be happy <laughs> about it. Matt, pussy, <laughs> He's like, laughing. shut up, pussy. This is, he like, kept, kept just looking around and everything and being like, this is ridiculous. This is just <laughs> so ridiculous. I'm like, dumb. dude, fucking not right now. Well, it was ridiculous. I got it a was. jaywalking ticket in Columbia, insane. South Carolina at 2 in the morning. And we were getting written up for like... One hit of weed. We were fucking older than this guy, and he's like, fucking, yeah. my weed pipe's on his car, and it's just like, dude. Yeah, this is ridiculous. Dude, the best thing, he's like, you guys are free to leave, and I'm like, I can have my bull back? And he's like, yeah, and I'm like, thank you. <laughs> then we, we jaywalked again to a fucking Walgreens, baby. Yeah, we to did. To get, like, nothing. Got, like, hot pockets. I got hot pockets. I got hot pockets and microwave. I got them. barbecue chips, and you got a that hot was pocket. Nice. That was, dude. The uh, hot pockets were worth it. Yeah, well, it was all worth it, dude. Then the rest of the time, we just kept doing that judge. Oh, yeah. Just like, the sick nugs. Yeah, dude. if we had actually gone to court, it's like, wait, there was no cherry in the bowl? <laughs> wait, so the bowl was cherried? Nice. <laughs> you didn't have to light it? Sick. <laughs> Let me see this piece. Nice shotgun. <laughs> dude, oh, this would get you ripped. Is this a steamroller? Like, well, technically, yeah, it's no water. Damn. It's a good judge. A, dude, the judge would have hooked us up. You would have fucking, you would have been in that holding cell again, dude. Fuck the judge. <laughs> <laughs> I would have fought for our civil liberties, dude. <laughs> That was the best when I did that down at, uh, when I got a permit from my dad, I got like caught up in some bureaucratic bullshit, dude. And they're like, they sent me to the wrong line. I waited for two hours and, uh, the, fucking lady, <laughs> the lady was like, you have the wrong forms. And I was like, you're a servant of the law and my tax dollars. And she was like, dude, stop. And I was like, all right, sorry. Fuck it. <laughs> I give up <laughs> instantly fold it. Like, yeah, you're right. No, never mind it. Oh, I don't man. think the tax goes to this specifically. So someone else pays you. <laughs> it was fully bitched out. It was dude, like... <laughs> and then they drug you out like the Asian dude. Yeah, dude. That's sick. If the, I wonder if that's just how that Asian dude gets around. <laughs> just, that was actually that wasn't him getting bullied. That was his servants, dude. That's, he just refuses to use a wheelchair. He's, he's royalty, like, dude. He just has his servants drag. He him hit around. on the full like supermarket toddler, dude. It was just like, Meh. yeah, he couldn't get skittles, so he was like, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> it's so funny because he was totally right. I was like, dude, I got to get home. Imagine if your wife's yeah. like, come on, blah blah blah, and you're, yeah. you're like, well, I got to stay. And you're like, no, fuck that, don't get off. He's probably like, well, I can't get off. They're like, get the fuck out. And he's like, me. <laughs> I mean, at that point, I would have just fuck, yeah. man. What so do I guess you do? we got to tell our listeners to watch a lot of stuff, a lot of homework. There's a lot of homework. Yeah, there's after homework this. this week. Watch the Pepsi commercial if you haven't. It's already a week old. Yeah, old news. It's and then uh, watch the Chinaman get ripped off that <laughs> fucking plane. That's about as funny as it gets. <laughs> Because just him screaming is so funny. It is fucking And, and the, the white lady, lady the afterwards, white lady being of course, outraged. making it all about herself. Like, this is I can't believe I'm seeing this. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Just, meanwhile, there's dudes in fucking uh, Syria with like trying to breathe, like <gasps> getting fucking chemical attacks. It's like, this is the worst thing I've ever seen. It's like, well, fucking be happy. They're not breathing fucking poison out That'd of the air. It would be great if Syria was just filled with white women that were outraged. <laughs> like, after every bombing, they're like, what? <laughs> this is crazy. I can't believe it. That is literally the worst thing this I've is ever seen. Literally, had. this is crazy. Ugh. Oh, man. Well, fucking God. That's some good stuff.